Do dudes ever go in your chest and just realize, wow, I've got a lot of junk. I'm a hoarder. I better get rid of all this. Well, today I'm going to be showing you three different trash chests that work absolutely amazing so you can get rid of all this junk because you honestly don't need this stuff. What's going on, my dudes? Welcome to the channel. I'm Quitty Bags, and today, my dudes, I'm going to be showing you three different trash chests that you guys could use on Bedrock Edition. Now, two of these work on Minecraft Java Edition, but the third one doesn't. So just letting you guys know that before you actually go ahead and make these. So let's get into these. I'm going to show you guys all the supplies for each and every single trash chest, and I'm going to show you guys how to build them step by step and uh, show you how fast they are and how good they are because honestly, we got to get rid of some of the trash ever our chests. We, we can't hoard anymore, my dudes. No more hoarding. All right, coming up to one of the simpler trash chests is this guy over here. Very simple um, redstone clock in the back connected to a dispenser with lava under underneath with a chest a hopper dispenser lava and then a few pieces of redstone and a couple repeaters so i'm gonna go over what you guys actually need here we need one chest one hopper one dispenser one lava bucket two redstone repeaters seven pieces of redstone and one redstone torch so the first thing we're gonna do is dig a uh, two deep hole grab some temp blocks build two high build one over top like that l shape Go down here and uh, crouch. Actually, you don't need to crouch. Place your dispenser like that and then go ahead and above it and get rid of all that stuff now. Now fill in one high like that. Drop a lava bucket down and place a block. And now you have a lava bucket facing underneath of the dispenser. Make sure your uh, dispenser is facing downwards. If it's like this, you got it wrong, okay? Next thing you're gonna do is go ahead, grab your hopper, hop on top of the hopper, and then uh, hop on top of the hopper and drop your chest, you know? And then there you go, you have the actual trash chest set up now. Now we're gonna go behind this bad boy and we're gonna do one, two of redstone. And then you're gonna grab a repeater, face it um, this way, just like that. And then one this way, just like that. Go around with redstone, connect like that. So in total, there should be seven pieces of redstone here. And then all you're gonna do is place a torch, let it light up. And then you're gonna break this torch, place down a piece of redstone. And I did it too slow. Let's be a little quicker there, Quinny. Ready, three, two, one, boom. And there you go, you have your automatic trash chest and uh, this will get rid of all the items you don't want anymore. Oh, I should put that lava bucket in there. That'll cause an issue. Uh, but yeah, it gets rid of all the items and burns them because they're not in the dispenser anymore. So this is one of the easiest, but now you, you might notice this is kind of annoying. How do, you, how do you turn this thing off? Well, you can't. So um, this is just option one and I'm gonna show you guys an option in now that uh, actually uses a lever. All right, now here's the option with a lever here. We have a very simple redstone clock. And uh, as we can see here, we have a lever. We turn this on and it actually makes it work. And uh, we can throw this piece of redstone in here for an example. And boom, it's already burned. And there you go. And you can actually turn it off after. So it's not annoying like that other one over there. So I'm gonna show you guys how to build this one now. So we're gonna need one chest, one hopper, one dispenser, one lava bucket, one redstone repeater, one redstone torch, five pieces of redstone, one lever. All right, let's get started and build this thing. And I do apologize, you need three blocks. I almost missed that part. We need three blocks. Don't forget about your three blocks. So the first thing we're gonna do is build a V-shape just like this. Delete those two at the bottom, boom, you have a V-shape. And then we're gonna put a lever right here and you can flick it downwards. Then we're gonna put a repeater on top just like that. We're gonna put a redstone torch underneath of the lever like that. Then you're gonna grab redstone like this, and there you go. And if you turn this on, it'll click back and forth. Now, if you guys wanna adjust the speed, you can make it slower using this, but um, I imagine you want it to burn stuff as fast as possible, so don't adjust the speed. All right, we can turn that off for now. All right, next thing we're gonna do is come around like this. So put another piece of redstone, another piece of redstone, another piece of redstone, and another piece of redstone. So one, two, three, four, five pieces of redstone in total now. And we're gonna dig down here. And we are going to put some temp blocks like this. And we can get rid of those ones. And let's go down and put our dispenser. So make sure you put your dispenser, make sure the hole is facing downwards. And then we can fill this in like that, put a lava bucket down and put a grass block down just like that. And then get rid of that. Next thing we're gonna do is hop on top, place a hopper down, and then we can grab our chest and we're gonna do the same thing. Go on top, whoop, go on top like that and boom. And we can throw all this stuff in here and it should burn it. And it is, which is very nice. So there we go. That's how to build the second one. Now, this second one is only for Bedrock Edition. Sadly, um, Java Edition, it does not work with this setup. And coming up to our third trash chest, this can be used on Java and Bedrock. 
we have our third contestant here and i'm going to show you guys how to build this one this one actually uses a comparator that detects there's an item in there and then when it detects an item it causes a redstone signal and then reverses back into the dispenser and the dispenser shoots something out the bottom so let's show you guys how to build it first we need to check out the supplies one chest one hopper one dispenser one lava bucket one redstone comparator one redstone repeater and five pieces of redstone so let's grab all these and let's build this thing so the first thing we're going to do is dig all the way down again and we're going to dig too high and then put one block over top just like that and we're going to go down and place our dispenser like that break that we got to get back up and then oh excuse me and then we're going to go ahead and put our lava bucket down right there just like that break all the temp blocks then you're going to hop up here put your um hopper down and then your chest and then after that we're going to go behind it face a comparator like that make sure the comparator is pointing outwards the arrow is going that way and then we're going to place a piece of redstone like this and then we're going to put a repeater like this and then we're going to go all the way around like that and now we're going to test this thing out and we're going to throw all this stuff in it and as you guys can see one by one this is actually emptying the traps out of the chest and into the lava and dispensing it and uh yeah that was actually pretty quick but um definitely out of all three of them i would say this guy is the best because you have a switch on and off sadly it doesn't work for java um but this guy's pretty good too if you just want to get rid of stuff fast and uh it's in a place where it doesn't matter if it's too noisy but if you want one that's not as noisy this is the better one for java edition right now because it doesn't have a lever on it doesn't have a lever like that one but at least it doesn't go off constantly because this one's just rapid fire all day long right so i'd recommend building this one if you're on bedrock edition i'd recommend building this one on java edition and uh this one if you really want to build it go ahead and build it it's just kind of a cool design all right my dudes that's gonna be it for today thank you for watching this video these are my top three trash chest designs i really actually like these designs i'm gonna build the left one on my world when i can and i'm gonna build the middle one on my java edition world because it's gonna come in handy and it'll get rid of all your trash for you instead of hoarding them and hanging on to all the you know unuseful stuff so thank you so much for watching smash the like button on your way don't forget to hit that sub button i'd really appreciate if you guys smash the sub button on your way out we're on the road to 30,000 subs and i'd appreciate every single one of you to smash that sub button all right my dudes have yourself an amazing day thank you and peace out my dudes